referee looks at his watch. Any second now. Hello, welcome back to Want My Bet TV. I'm Tom. I'm Ollie. And today we're previewing Newcastle. All the stats you need to know ahead of the up and coming season. Tom has done all the research. Sure have. And he's going to share it with you guys now. I have. Um, so, Toonami. Um, so, currently, Rafa Benitez is still the manager. There's been rumours that he might be going, speculation that he might be leaving. But he's been in charge since March 2016. Done a great job. Amazing job. So he stayed when they got relegated, yeah. got them back up into the Premier League. The f he's a fan's favourite yeah. because he did that. Um, the fans absolutely love him. Last year, like last season, they finished 10th in the end. I think, personally, with that squad, they massively overachieved. Oh, yeah. Like, I, would, I thought they were really going to struggle. Um, they were pretty good defensively last year, which surprised quite a few, especially at home. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, they did well to finish 10th. Who's the key players? Key players, still going to be John Joe Shelby. Yeah. Pulled strings. There was a lot of people saying he should have gone to the World Cup with England. Mm, I so didn't sure agree. But he's a good player. Does yeah. well for them. Makes them tick. Lascelles, the centre-half. Jamal Lascelles. Um, centre-half, skipper. He basically organises them. Yeah. Matt Ritchie. Yeah, I reckon. Uh, the winger. They've been linked with a few other clubs as well over the summer, but he's still there at the moment. And then their striker, Azozi Perez. Yeah. Um, he was the top scorer last season. He got eight league goals. You need uh, your striker to be getting at least ten. Yeah. To give yourself a chance normally. Um, so that so assuming they've bought a world class striker. You'd think that, wouldn't you? Yeah. What they've done is sold Mitrovic. Okay. So it makes you, sense. You could have brought Mitrovic back in, maybe. To one of your competitors, you'll be probably there or there. Yeah, about. they're going to be yeah, yeah, yeah. challenging right. with Fulham. So they've sold Mitrovic. Great. They've brought in a few good players, though. Um, they've just signed a striker, Japanese striker called Muto from Mainz for about 9.5 mil. Don't know a huge amount about him. Scored yeah. a few um, goals in the Bundesliga last year. They've also signed Dubravka, um, who was the goalie they had on loan last season uh, from okay. Sparta Prague. They've signed Ki Sung Young, which is a good bit of business, I thought. Yeah. Um, centre midfielder, South Korean from Swansea, centre yeah. midfielder. That's a good bit of business. Um, but other than that, they've got Kennedy back on loan as well. He's, from I, I rate him. That's He's a good, good. sign. He's got a bit of creativity, takes people on. I think... Getting him back is key. Yeah. Um, I don't know how many goals he'll score because he's not really. No, he's not prolific, but yeah, he's but he's a he's, good player. Good to yeah. have. Good solid prem player. Yeah. Um, they sold a few. Sold uh, Michael Mourinho to Real Sociedad, twelve mil. Good bit of business that. And they sold Mbemba, Mbemba. Uh, to Porto for eight mil. So they've recouped a little bit of money. And Mitrovic have sold for like twenty mil. Basically, they're cash rich right now. Yeah. So Benitez is getting a little bit annoyed that he's not given, mm. being given a little fans. bit of cash to go yeah. and spend. Um, verdict. Yeah. My verdict on them is getting in Kennedy from Chelsea is a good bit of business. They needed yeah. him. Selling Mitrovic isn't ideal, I don't think. I know he probably didn't get on with a lot of the um, Newcastle players and was Benitez really? didn't rate him, yeah. So they've got rid of him. I think... Newcastle overachieved last season to finish 10. Yeah. And I don't think that they've improved the squad from last year. Not at all. Sold a few players. I think, basically, if Benitez stays throughout the whole season, Newcastle yeah. will be safe. Mm -hmm. If Benitez goes, I think they could be in massive danger of getting relegated. It's a bold. I think they'll just about be safe. Yeah. I reckon. It can be a tough season, though. Tough, tough, tough season for uh, Newcastle, I think. 14th to 16th. I think with their fans, with their home form, mm. they'll be safe. Because they absolutely love their football there and they get properly behind their team. I just think there's a lot better teams than Newcastle in yeah. the league this year. Teams that have spunked a bit of money and will be stronger than them. Yeah. Um, so I think Newcastle are going to struggle. Yeah, I've gone 14th to 16th. Key is keeping Rafa Benitez. Yeah. Agreed? Agreed. Nice. Right, that's it for that preview. Check back. There's plenty more to look at. All the other teams. And we'll see you soon. See you later. See ya.
Any second now. Bubba.